I'm a watchmaker here in the Netherlands and welcome to the Watchmaker Book Club and I try to show you practical books which ones to read to buy but we have quite a collection and I would like to show you some beautiful books as well and this one it's not the oldest we have but it is pretty old I would like to show you uh, Le Pote, and that is something really special because this one is from 1755. I will show you more, show you in more detail. Well, there it is. The smell is amazing, really old book. Um, and here it is. Le Pot. and at that time it was mostly uh, text and I would like to show you well and with the text um, it was the only source of uh, information at the time um, you had to read it and so all the watchmakers in previous centuries who uh, used this book it's quite amazing but what I really do love again 1755 is how useful the information still is here the cylinder escapement and other way uh, other kinds of escapements Here's, of course, uh, a clockwork. Here, an early form of the, uh, the balance spring. Still different as the one we uh, recognize with uh, 13 to 14 windings. And it's just all there. drawing from 1753 so. but the orientation of the wheels and just the ba basic facts about uh, watchmaking is just about the same again not the oldest one because I have one from uh, the 17th century so uh, 1600 and that's just about more about um, uh, the sun and solar systems and uh, sundials but i just wanted to show you um, le pot beautiful stuff 1755 hope to see you soon see you bye bye